The dark side of the moon, which can't be seen from Earth, has long been a source of fascination, an unexplored frontier celebrated in popular culture, most notably perhaps by Pink Floyd's record-breaking song. But now, thanks to a pioneering Chinese space mission, it is being explored for the very first time. The Chang'e 4 spacecraft was launched last month and successfully landed on the far side of the moon at 2.26 GMT on Thursday. The whole process was as expected. The result was pretty precise and the landing was very stable. The current landing location is our most ideal landing place. In other words, we were right on target. The Chang'e 4 carries a rover which will study the moon's terrain and send back samples to Earth. Scientists say the far side of the moon is geologically different to the near side. One of the goals of this mission is to find out more about what lies beneath the surface. But China's space dreams don't end there. It wants to catch up with the United States and Russia and one day even lead the world space race. China is uh, treating the moon as uh, the first big outpost in deep space uh, for its long-term plans. Uh, it's already sent several missions to the moon. It plans to send even more in the future, including a sample return mission at some point. But China is also setting its sights for Mars and uh, the asteroids and probably beyond. It's been almost 50 years since Neil Armstrong became the first person to walk on the moon. Now the space race has a new contender, China. But as much as our world has changed, the moon's mysteries continue to capture people's imagination. Victoria Gatenby, Al Jazeera.